right, guys, we are in the car. As you can see that, we're in the car, me and Simmy. And it is literally a hailstorm out there. Like, <laughs> is that right? I am feeding him his PB&J. He wants another piece. There is like ice all over the car. We've had it on and it's like defrosting, so it's not as bad now. But when we first got out here, there was ice all over the car here and it was just so bad. It is like 30 degrees, so it's kind of scary. It's gonna be freezing rain. Yeah, you can see it a little bit. The whole car is just covered in a glare of ice. Simeon doesn't know what to think of this. I think he likes this kind of weather. Poor thing, he can't play outside very well in it though. <laughs> they have the road clear the main roads with sand and salt so it'll be safe i've got to go to town get some stuff for our church dinner on sunday so let's go so i just got out i heard some rubbing so i was out checking the car we just got on the road it's always good to check your tires so we're safe and good the road's actually not that bad at all it's nasty but the road's not bad Also, Nathan, he's got a meeting tonight with board members from the facility that we're renting. So he needs a haircut, definitely. Hair everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> we are here in town. Simeon is sleeping and Nathan is in supercuts getting his haircut. So I just wanted to hop on here and welcome you guys back. So I have to go to the grocery store today, get a few things for our church dinner on Sunday. So that's what I need to get today and Nathan's just getting a haircut too because he really needs one. It is super, super nasty outside. It's like freezing rain and just really cold. It's like 30 degrees so it can be really dangerous if the roads, oops, if the roads are not sanded but the main roads are good so we're all set. They're Really sanded and dirty and our car is nice and dirty, but hey, we are safe. So thank the Lord for sand trucks here in the state of Maine. Hopefully we won't be that much longer in town because I want to get home and do some organizing for you guys. I really needed to organize my cabinetry, my cabinets better, up, that are up top in my motorhome. They are just filled with things that I don't use. So basically they're just full of stuff that it's just taking up space. I have some stuff that I want to make space for. I want to have a cabinet that has like all my smoothie stuff and also has my um, blender in there. I really, really want to get that kind of organized and I thought you guys would like to see that process. I don't know how it's going to go. It's, I would love to get it done today. I just don't know. Simeon's sleeping right now so he's probably not going to sleep later and I probably don't want him to because then he won't sleep good tonight. So we'll just see what I can get done this afternoon and I'll just show you guys what I do. I need it at the grocery store so I actually need to run to Hannaford too because I have to get a few things there but after that we are gonna hit the road home Every time I want 
talk, you make your noises like you want to talk too. Right? Alright, we're home from Rockland. Simeon is out and about playing and he gets so frustrated when toys just don't go the way he wants them to go. Right? So I'm going to whip up a smoothie. Mainly I'm going to make it for him because, guys, he is obsessed with smoothies. probably everything out. I'm going to pack away most everything in this tote right here. I've got this big tote that will be perfect for like the bigger items and stuff like that. So I think tonight I'm just going to do these three top cabinets and then this one right here on the opposite side. Cheyenne asked me if I wanted to keep my coffee stuff in here. She knows this would be a great place for plates. And I love our coffee machine, and I just don't foresee us needing this right at the moment. earlier today I wanted to try to get all my smoothie stuff like compiled in one area along with my blender so I think I'm gonna put my blender right here and all my artificial sweeteners and things I'm gonna set up here here is some liquid artificial sweetener I think he's a destroyer Seriously, this is what he does, you guys. But look how good this is looking, you guys. And this is my smoothie stuff. Loving it. So it seems like we have smoothies so often, so this is just gonna be really convenient and easy just to go to. Simi thinks I'm leaving. I found him standing in front of the door, blocking my entrance and exit. He wants to go. You say, Daddy, take me with you. So this is definitely normal routine for Simeon. Anytime Cheyenne or I get through this door, he thinks it's his turn to go too. And he's usually sad when we leave. So if Cheyenne's got to go out or I've got to go out and he's got to stay in, he's not too happy about it. <laughs> oh, love you. Oh. Oh, I love you, buddy. That's sad. Mm. 
Daddy's got to go get pizza sauce so we can eat a pizza because Mommy's cooking. And then I got to go to the church. All right, here you go. Try a green pepper. See what he does. Try it. <laughs> Is it good? Mmm. 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 Try it. <laughs> and there it goes. Out goes the pepper. Let's try it again. <laughs> what? Is that good? It's healthy. It's good for you. <laughs> Alright, so I have prep. <laughs> I love you. Alright, so I have prepped the toppings for our pizza tonight. And Nathan had to run to the store to get me pizza sauce because, I don't know, I forgot pizza sauce today when I was in town. So, the crust is cooked. Here it is. It looks delicious. And um, here is the toppings. I've got tomato, onion, and green pepper. And then I've got cheese and pepperoni also. You want another one? All right. <laughs> Is that good? Oh, there's the other one I thought you ate. It fell on the floor. I thought you ate this. Did you spit it out? And mommy wasn't looking? So as soon as daddy gets home, we're going to pizza. So this is just the fathead dough pizza that I have made so many times. Um, and it's in one of our videos probably way back we can link that down. i don't even usually make the cauliflower one just because that one's so much work for me personally this fathead dough pizza is so much better than the cauliflower so this is so much fun